Hi everyone, I'm gonna do a quick video on what I did to stay fit during my pregnancy. Uh, this won't be super long, I'm gonna have to do probably multiple parts, I'm sure I'm gonna forget something. But I just wanted to do a quick video before Levi decides to hurt himself again um, on how I stayed fit. So going into pregnancy, I had just done two rounds of Insanity, which is a beach body workout, which was amazing. Um, Insanity is really tough, and I, but I'm thankful I did it. I went into pregnancy with you know being in great shape. Um, I also lifted a lot of weights. I'm big in weightlifting, and um, I went to my husband's little CrossFit area and his gym back in we were in Del Rio, Texas, and um, squatted a lot with him. So I would say the workout I did the most during pregnancy was was definitely squatting. Um, I had done a lot of research on the best workouts to do when you're pregnant and just how helpful squatting is to increase your pelvic floor, to tone your legs down there and keep your butt nice and toned, which is where most girls carry a lot of their weight during pregnancy. And not to mention, it just helps with your self-esteem. Like just squatting for me and knowing that I'm trying to tone that region was just so awesome. So uh, we know when you work out, it just helps all the blood flow um, to the baby and to the placenta and get that nice oxygen going through your blood. So I always had more energy after I worked out. Even if I would feel so tired going to the gym, I was so thankful that I did. Um, at the time, I really loved going to the gym because I was in the middle of nowhere and I needed to get out of the house. And so that was like the best thing for me was to go to an air conditioning gym and I would do about half an hour of cardio, sometimes an hour, depending on how good I felt. And then I would squat and do some, usually some arm weight. And after a while, of course, your belly does get big, and it's hard just to do the regular squat. Um, but I would do a lot of sumo squats, which was more, you know, weights between your legs, squatting down in a sumo position. And that was really helpful when your belly gets huge, and it's really hard to do that regular kind of squat. Levi's going to the dog food, like normal. Um, so those were the things I did the most. I would bring my resistance band with me a lot. Uh, when I was traveling, and that was a great way to um, do a lot of leg stuff, um, shoulder, biceps, even when I was on the go. And he is being absolutely crazy today. So um, I really felt like working out and staying super fit really helped my labor and helped my recovery as well. I didn't go, you know, into you know, postpartum recovery, feeling so out of shape, like regardless, you're going to be a little bit out of shape and you're going to, you know, your abs are going to be kind of disintegrated. But I felt like I gave myself the best possible chance at getting back into shape quickly. I gained 27 pounds total and I felt really good about that number. It was right in the middle, you know, average range. And I think a lot of it has to do with, yeah, like I was eating a lot and definitely eating more calories, but also was burning calories too. Like I wasn't just sitting down and eating all day. Um, also like being up and walking and on your hands and knees, especially doing like, you know, the rocking your hips. Those are all things that help the baby get into the right position for labor. And so, you know, sitting back reclining is are not the best things to do when you're pregnant. Um, also just with blood flow, so circulation, I mean, you don't want to be on your feet too much when you're pregnant, but sitting down all day is not the best thing for, you know, blood pooling. You're going to have more swelling as well. Um, I had my wedding rings on the day I delivered, so I never got really swollen. My feet never really got swollen. Uh, I felt really good. I had a really good pregnancy, and I think a lot of that has to do with my nutrition as well as my fitness routine. I will do a video on nutrition and kind of what I did and what I do now kind of what I ate, uh, but for sure, I would say if I could list one workout for a pregnant mom or, you know, if you're going to be pregnant soon, it's definitely to keep squatting. Um, you can squat with weights in your hands and squat down and push up with the weights. That's a good one too. Help work the shoulders and the arms at the same time because realistically, you might not want to go to the gym for an hour. You might just want to go to the gym for 15 minutes or so. So those are some things that I did, and I swear it helped with pushing and with everything like that. Sorry. Um, so those are the things that I've done, and if y'all have any questions or want any more detail on to, I could probably write a list of what I did exactly, um, but I will do a video on what I did postpartum to get back in shape. So stay tuned for that. Bye, guys.